friends, welcome back to my channel and a very special welcome if you're new here. My name is Jen, I'm a certified weight loss and nutrition coach and I'm on WW Personal Point. Happy Saturday, it's Saturday, so you know what that means. It's grocery haul day. I'm excited to share with you everything that I picked up for the week, what's on my menu, what you'll see Monday for meal prep. Meal prep is back, so definitely stay tuned for three really yummy recipes coming your way on Monday. So if you're excited, give this video a big huge thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not, because I do a grocery haul every Saturday and five videos every single week. Check out the description box down below for nutrition coaching. Highly recommend macros and calories. That is how I've lost over 120 pounds, as well as one-on-one -on -one coaching. If you would like to chat with me directly. Links, discounts to my favorite things, and come join our Facebook group. It's free, it's a supportive community, and we'd love to have you over there as well. So let me flip you around and let's jump in to the grocery haul. So here is this week's grocery haul. I did Walmart pickup just because I'm so busy this week that I just picked up all of my groceries. We also have a pot roast cooking in the crock pot behind us. So let me jump into what I picked up for the week. Troy asked for some Wonder Bread. I do not eat Wonder Bread because there's no nutritional value, but I will say it's nice soft bread and Troy asked for it for some peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. I ordered quite a few of the Chobani Zero Sugar Yogurts. They were out of stock with every flavor except for mixed berry. So they substituted with three mixed berries which is fine. I just wanted to make sure that I had a few yogurts on hand. We really enjoyed the pepperoni minis this last week. As you saw in my what I eat in a day on Wednesday, if you didn't see that video, I'll link it down below for you. I made the best little mini pizza on a non bread. And so we picked up another pack of the pepperoni minis. I also grabbed some brown sugar and some powdered sugar because I have some baking things in mind. Since I didn't go to Sprouts, I did pick up the fajita seasoned chicken from Walmart. This is all white meat chicken. This was actually on sale and you know I love to have pre-cooked pre-shredded ready to go chicken on hand it just makes super quick easy high protein snacks lunches and even dinners I'm excited to try the fajita one I've never tried the Walmart brand and yay they had fair life last week when I ordered from Walmart they were out of fair life I'm so happy to have this back in my life this is the milk that I use to make my protein shakes because there's 13 grams of protein in one cup so no almond milk for me when I can get 13 grams of protein in my fair life milk. I also grabbed a can of corn. This is for a dinner recipe. And then Troy asked for some pickles. Again, I wanted to go to Sam's Club this week. I'm hoping to get there next week, but uh, he asked for some pickles. So I grabbed the little baby ones from Vlasic. Some milk for Troy, some 1% skim milk. And then as always, I grabbed another pack of the Bob Evans pre-made mashed potatoes. I like to have these on hand. I put the chicken in there with some gravy and some veggie, and it's just the perfect meal. Super easy, pre-done, ready to go and it's a great way to stay on track get in a healthy carb some protein and some fats two prune juice for troy we know that this is something that's on the list every week he also asked for some fritos last week i picked up that dean's french onion dip and he finished up the chips we had on hand and asked for some fritos for the dip we're gonna do a barbecue night this week we have a lot of meat in our freezer and we decided that we were going to just grill up a bunch of meat to have on hand so i grabbed some smoky applewood marinade mix I'm going to put this on chicken thighs and have Troy throw those on our Blackstone grill. That's a great way to have healthy proteins on hand. Just meal prep them, have them pre-made, ready to go. So he is going to grill a ton of meat a little bit later this week. I also picked up some tartar sauce because we found a box of Trader Joe's fish sticks in the freezer. We also just cleaned out and reorganized our freezer. And so I grabbed tartar sauce for those. We were also out of mustard. And one of the things we're going to grill up is some burgers. So I picked up some mustard for that. I needed some unsweetened applesauce for some baking recipes. Thank you to everybody who commented on my what I eat in a day saying you would love holiday recipes. So stay tuned for fall, Thanksgiving, Christmas recipes coming your way. So I needed some unsweetened applesauce as well as a big, huge can of 100% pure pumpkin. On Sunday, tomorrow, I have some pumpkin recipes for you guys. So definitely make sure you're subscribed 
and your bells turned on so you don't miss all the fall holiday baking. And then lots of produce. I was completely out of onions, so I wanted a, so I ordered a three pound bag, and then I ordered one single sweet onion. I'm gonna have Troy grill up some onions as well so we can put grilled onions on the chicken and the burgers. And my favorite for grilling and sauteing is a sweet onion. Troy asked for oranges, so I got a huge three pound bag of oranges. They sound really good, actually. So I didn't get any berries this week. We're gonna, we're gonna focus on oranges for the week. One bell pepper, and I'm not sure what this is. It's like a little growth on my green bell pepper, but I needed that for a recipe. Also for meal prep, zucchini. I am making a really yummy dessert using zucchini, and then I need that for a dinner recipe too, so I ordered four zucchinis. Some white mushrooms for a dinner recipe, cilantro for a dinner recipe, and then, no surprise to anyone, a huge bag of mini cucumbers. These are my favorite, just crunchy snack as a side with lunch or dinner. This bag isn't as big as the Sprouts bag. We'll see if I like these as much because I love the ones from Sprouts, but we love a good mini crunchy cucumber. I also ordered a case of Diet Coke and Coors Light, which Troy has already put away in the garage. So that is this week's grocery haul. Let me go ahead and jump into what's for dinners. And meal prep is back on Monday, so let me show you what I'll be doing for Monday's meal prep. Say hi to everybody. Say hi. We did our grocery haul in Palmer's right here for any food that may drop. There's no food that's gonna drop, Bubba. No, there's no food that's gonna drop. There's no food that's gonna drop. Crazy dog, crazy dog. So here is what is on my menu for the week. Today's Saturday, out to dinner. Tomorrow, we're actually going to my in-laws for dinner. She's making sloppy joes and homemade apple pie, so I'm super excited for that. On Monday, I'm making Italian hot dish. So this is a really good comfort food pasta recipe. You'll see this in Wednesday's What I Eat in a Day. Tuesday's a leftover night. Wednesday, we're doing garlic butter chicken with zucchini. Thursday, I was gonna do Sloppy Joe's, but instead we're gonna do that as our barbecue night. We're gonna cook up all that meat on our Blackstone Grill, and then Friday we will eat up everything that's left over from earlier in the week. Here's what you'll be seeing for Monday's meal prep. So for breakfast this next week, Chaffles are back. You guys love chaffles. I love chaffles. So we're making pumpkin chaffles. Lunch is going to be Italian meatballs. I've been craving meatballs. And then for dessert this week, I'm making zucchini bread. Troy loves zucchini bread. I love zucchini bread. So stay tuned for all three recipes on Monday. Thank you for joining me for this week's grocery haul. I hope you enjoyed seeing all the good stuff that I picked up for the week. Stay tuned for a really fun holiday baking fall recipe video tomorrow. You're going to be really excited about the recipes I'm sharing. And if you enjoyed the grocery haul, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not. Turn your bell on so you don't miss any future videos. Check out that description box for nutrition coaching, links and discounts to my favorite things, and come join our Facebook group, another community that would love to have you. Happy Saturday, friends, and I'll see you in tomorrow's video. Bye!